What is going on guys, DBG here. Today we're going to be doing a gameplay with the Vault Reward Free Galaxy Opal. So lads, this is going to be with Danilo Gallinari. So huge thank you to Josh618, sorry, I'm playing too much WWE, saying 619 for letting me use his account. So again, I am still absolutely exhausted today, so um, I'm going to record this video. I'm gonna get two more done. I like it's 8 p.m. right now, man. I'm gonna be in bed by 10 p.m. today. I am exhausted. But Danilo Gallinari, six foot ten. He's at 19 halves, 39 goals. Half catch and shoot corner specialist, post spin, interceptor, off ball pass, blinders, limitless spot up rhythm, slithery dream shake, dead eye sniper, green machine, strip ball bullet, racing to pressure, post playmaker, slippery off ball, as well as 39 goal badges. Uh, including clumps, Intimidator, Revan Chaser, Post Lockdown, Tars Defender, Six Three, Chef. So, and he's got a lot of good badges right here. He's big, he's got a long wingspan, got good post moves, great shooting. Not great dunking, but not awful. Defensively, again, not awful, not brilliant either. But he's got really good, he's got really okay speed to well acceleration, especially for someone at 6'10. A lot of things are 88. Like, none of these stats are too brilliant, but his animations are what really should separate. His animations are really what should separate him from kind of, you know, just your kind of average card. That's the real thing with Danilo Gallinari is that, like, look at his height of him. Look at the height of him. Oh my God, I just agree with the meter. I just want to say that might be my biggest. That might be my greatest ever achievement is greening with the meter. I'm so bad with it's weird, like I played meter in two. I played used to play meter a lot in this game. But I'm so bad with meter right now. Gallo base on quick is a good release. If you guys don't know about Gallo base on quick, what ball is this? I've never seen someone using the yellow ball before. I think it's yellow anyway. But Gallo base on quick is the same release as I think. Oh, what's the guy's name? Stromal Swift, I think has it. His release was really good. But Gallo Upper is really nice as well. Like, this is when the easier release the green the game. I'm not saying easiest, but the easier, definitely. The fade is super nice as well. Again, Dame behind the back is, it's still, it's not very good because it's not as good as Scotty. And Dame behind the back started off the year good, but you can kind of change directions very easily off it. Like Release wise, again, he's going to have one of the top, one of the better shooters in the game, I guess. Like when Gallo's wide open, he's going to hit. And he's going to hit very, very consistently. Um, and yeah, that's why, like, I do think, in my opinion, his release is quite a bit better than, like, a Hito Turkaloos. But I don't, I don't think his player build feels as big as Hito's. Again, he does get either quick or shifty, one of those two dribble styles. For me, he just doesn't feel... He shoots better from deep. I will admit that, he's a better shooter, but he just doesn't feel like he moves as well. But in my opinion, Hito Turkaloos moves ridiculously well for somebody with, like... Off six, some of the six ten. I just, I don't know what it is. Damn, I just feel that he moves super well. But um, yeah. Hot zones everywhere on the floor. And here, able to green threes with ease. So like, look, there are no flaws here to Gallo. A Gallo is gonna be one of the top, probably a top fifteen card in the game. He's like, you see that Larry Bird card under the basket? He's a way better version of that Larry. He's he's way better than that Larry. It is not even a not even a bait. He is significantly, significantly better than that Larry Bird. But yeah, so um, a guy, absolute sniper out here. He's gonna move and Look, is he going to be the greatest player in the game? No, but is he going to be a solid player for the vast majority of people that get him? Hell yeah. If you can get him in the vault, you got a good card in your hands. So anyway, now it's green three. It's just green one. Oh, the miracle is not going to happen again. We are probably not going to green straight out of the meter. Now let's go and get on to a game. So I think his best position is probably power forward. Uh, no, actually, use his, length, use his length and play him at small forward. As long as you don't give up, as long as you have someone to guard ball, he's gonna guard either wing position fine. Who do I wanna play the point? I mean, I guess I gotta use either. 
Screw it. I'm going to use this guy here. Need Gary Payton a second. Why is he? Is he 6'4"? No, he's only 6'3". Screw it. Why not? Um, I'm going to take out Siakam. Play Gallo there. I'm going to take out Yao and play... Yao, I guess. Yao, I guess. So a decent enough team. Like, his team's not too great. Not bad either. And Ray Allen in the team is pretty good. Probably should have put in Ray Allen for Booker. That would have been a smart decision, but... Screw it. It is what it is. So he's matching up to... His name is really LaFraud Jorbum. Are you speaking of that? Like, do you guys... Do you guys hear when uh, Magic Johnson acts... I don't even know if he actually did it, but he's called, he called Westbrook Westbrook. Which I find hilarious. I'm sorry. Like, if you can't... If you can't take slight jabs at guys that are worth a couple of hundred million dollars, who can you joke about? Like, who can you joke about? But, um... Yeah, like, again, we can't... We can't complain about... We can't call Westbrook washed because, as I pointed out on Twitter, a couple of days ago, him and LeBron did combine for 55 points. Like, and when two guys combine for 55, you can't really... Can't really knock them too much. Even if one of those two did score 50. What are you... Why are you spending a minute in your coach time settings? What are you doing, man? Well, you're, oh my god, you've spent a minute in your damn clutch time settings. Hey, RJ Barrett, Ja. Oh dear lord, he's matching up to Patrick Ewing. I saw Ja, I thought maybe I'd be safe, but um, this is going to be a very tough one. It's going to be a very, very tough matchup here on Ewing. And again, Dottom, Dunk. Okay, yeah. You're gonna pull it, pull out that. Not a chance. He's just too big. Wow, well, Jaff feels way bigger than Gary Payton. Second. Okay, we're good. Terrible shot. Good defense. Um, by Gallo. Give me that. Oh, you ain't recovered in time. I was convinced they'd switch to a different player. Hey, we're good. Gary Payton seconds got him. And it's a good steal. I don't know whether that was by Payton or Gallo, but whoever it was, it was a good steal. Give me that. Oh, it's a terrible shot by me. I choked. I actually choked that one there. There is no other way to describe it other than I choked. Switch hard, switch hard, switch hard. Gallo, you're there. No, you're not. Gallo, good defense, Gallinari. Good defense, Gallinari. Gallo's actually played some solid defense here on Ewing. And Yao almost gets the block right there. Oh, launch. Oh, come on. Your players literally will cannot inbound the ball when people press. Like, it happened to Ty like five times in 250. On next gen, your players literally, they just throw the ball into your opponent's hands. Give me that. Got a pass there by Gallo. Good shot there by Gary Payton. Second. I'm sorry, dude. Gary Payton second. Such a good shooter. Like that bait, I don't care about bait. Like people saying, oh, base eight's bad. No, no, no. Base eight on quick is such a nice release. Great stand, yeah. It's fine, I can live with that. It's fine. Oh, yeah, come on, Gallo. Come on, Gallo. Okay, can we at least get some space off of this? I don't think we can. And we shot the early because we had no stamina. Good pass. Good defense, Gallo. Come on, 2K. Give me one bailout animation. Gallo is probably going to end with zero points in this game. He's just... I just can't get that score. Like Ewing, he's being guarded by Ewing. Unless I score on the fast break, I'm pretty much screwed. And like just like that, I'm after putting up... That is... First of all, that's not, that's not an early. Second of all, that was not an open. Like I literally shot an early because of a contest and registered as open. Terrible shot. Big board. I mean, Gallo's done everything well except score the ball. And we're just getting caught in animations right now. I'm literally just getting caught in an animation every single time I try to do something. And Gallo misses the wide open. That's a bad miss from Gallinari. That is a bad miss from him. 
Steal. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Gary Payton a second, we're so late. Oh my god, Gallard, it's you, it's you, it's you. Ewing's not in any position to guard you here. Why? The players literally just stick to you like freaking glue. Have to put it up. Free board. Just dunk it. Good job, Tatum. We could come up with a we could come up with an egg right here from Gala. You it's just a attachment. He's not at that Ewing level. He's not at the top level. He's literally just worse heat artillery. Good block here. Come on. Let's run. Let's run Gary Payton in a second. Gala, you're wide open. Come on. There we go. Green. There we go. Like, he's open. He'll hit every single shot. Like, he will hit every single shot when he's open. He's one of the best players in the game at that. We're there. Gallo's there. Gallo's right there. And Gallo forces the miss. Let's go. And we gave wide, gave, gave wide open three. Because Ewing's just that much better than Gallo. Dex. Oh. Give me that. Lena. Free board, yo! Come on, that's pathetic, yo. Why is that everyone else's yo's are just so much better than when I use my yo? I don't own yo, but anytime I use yo, he straight up stinks for me. I've never used a yo that like actually snags boards, whereas everyone else's yo's just rebounds over me whenever I, I play with them. Charge. Gallo! Come on, man. Come on, Gallinari is literally just worse Hito. He's fine. He is a perfectly, perfectly fine card in this game. But that's the only word I can describe. Like he's literally, he's worse Hito Turkley. Oh yeah. Forward shot. That's an early again. He just keeps, I'm I, I will admit when I'm releasing badly, I am not releasing badly. He is just chucking earlies. He's just consistently chucking earlies. I don't know what's going on. Like, they're open. Everything's registering is open, but he's consistently chucking earlies. I lit, I tried to bring him back. It would not. It would not let me. Gary Payton a second. Great defense. Gallo, run the wing. Right to the basket, Gallo. Or not. Like, he just doesn't. He's just not good enough at anything. He's just a catch and shoot player. His movement's okay. He's a decent shooter. He's a decent shooter. I'll use him in TTO and I'll just dominate with him there. Like, that's the only thing is that, like, he doesn't... He's not the... He's not good enough at anything. He's, he can't do anything to go by Ewing. Like, Ewing is completely boxing him right here. Ewing is completely boxing him. And there's nothing he can do to score on Ewing. Leaner, green. Good shot. Like, if he gets any... If he even gets an inch of space, he will score every single time. If he gets even an inch of space, he'll score. The problem is, is that it's just kind of hard to get that inch. Because he's kind of slow at that small four position. When I said, oh, he's definitely best as a power forward. No, no, he's definitely best as a small forward. Give me that. Oh, he shot the damn leaner. He didn't set his feet. Oh, he's with a big small forward, lads. Trust me on that. He cannot live with a Ewing or anyone like that. He's just going to get eaten alive in power forward. The weird one the way the game is, but now nah, Ewing's a lot better. So I'm going to go and play another game when I'm a power forward. Or at small forward, sorry. Well, if anyone is not going to get eaten alive by a Ewing or you, you can, you can play power forward. Gallo come in there, and you know what? Ray Allen, you're a lot better in Devin Booker on defense. So, oh, I do apologize for using some of your last coins here. But um, I could see if we can get the win here, but he's definitely, definitely not a power forward. Let's see how we can get on here using him as small forward. So he's coming up against Tracy McGrady. Even though this would be a funny match, like this is a funny one, like he can more than match up to Rudy Gay. Playing Luca, Ray Allen, Tracy McGrady. So this is a really, really good squad as well. So again, this is probably another L because again, one man army against a team like this. The joys of clutch time matchmaking. Give me that. Yeah, I got him. Am I shooting from too deep? Or is it just, am I releasing badly? I don't know. Give me that, Leaner. Good shot, that's it. Why is everything early? How is everything green or early? I'm sorry, how is everything green or early?
I refuse to admit somebody is shot. Like, I'm telling you, somebody's shots are legitimately not early. Slightly, finally. I don't even care that I missed it. It just didn't say early. Oh, yeah, we got him. Good defense. Great, great defense, Gary Payton. Second. Let's run, Gallo. Come on. Quartz is too small in this game mode. Give me that. Good defense. Now I'm just chucking bad shots. Now I'm just rattled and I'm chucking bad shots. Face down. Oh, come on. Alright. It happens. It happens. You can get rattled quite easily in 2K, so. Hit him on the roll. Lucas shouldn't be back there. And it's a nice dunk there from Gallinari. Come on. Gallo is currently on the ground, and we are so out of position because of that. That's actually not a bad fail. Let's just reset. Let's just get our matchups right. Gallo should not be guarding ball anyway. And he's going to go to Rudy Gay in the corner. I thought I had that lane played. Oh, what are you doing? We got so blessed right there. Okay, let's just stop putting Gallo the ball in Gallo's hands. Bail out of hell. Come on, yo. Everyone else's yo is dominating. And anytime I use yo, he just struggles. Just like that, yo can't even guard Luka. Yo can't contest Luka. That's fine, it's Luka though. I'm completely cool with Luka Doncic just cooking me because Luka cooks everybody. Give me the fight. Oh, yeah, yo. Oh, yeah, yo, man. Come on. I'm using yeah like it's 2k19 again. Sit in front of him. Pinch. What? That's my, I think that's my fault. I actually do think that's I think that's my fault there. I think I messed up there. It's left Ray Allen wide open. Like why? Someone has one of my players has to be open. How are none of my players open? They triple teamed. How are none of my players open there? I, that makes no sense. Great defense there by Gallinari. Jaron Jackson Jr. goes and hacks. That makes up. That's not even on me. That's on the damn game. I'm literally there on the top of the three-point line. There are three defenders on me. Surely one of my players is going to be open to pass the ball. No, no, no. Whatever, whoever programmed offense decided, you know what? Let's make sure none of your players can get open ever. Nice, Gallo. Spin. Should be easy. Nope, he blows, blows the left. Steal. Okay, he's gonna get the, he's gonna get the shot. Good pass, good shot. That's good offense. Can't complain about that. That's good offense. I'm being absolutely cooked right here. I'm being absolutely cooked right here. Gallinari, you'll catch the ball. And just score. Please score. Please put the ball in the damn basket. Nope, he's not putting the ball in the damn basket. Please. You know what? Screw it. Screw it. Desperate times. That's a fake. Tried to go up and under. Okay, Gallo is literally just heat worse heat circular. Like, the more I'm using this card, the more he's lit. Like, he can catch. His movement is not good. He is literally just worse heat circular. Spin him. Come on. Come on, Gallo. Come on, Gallo. That's your shot. Gallo. That's, <laughs> that's a shot that you've got to at least make. Or just get a better. Trigger a better animation than that. And we lose it. I mean, no, no knocks my opponent. I'm trying to one man army with a card that's not very good. Good shot. And to prove a point, I'm gonna put the ball in the Ray Allen's hands right here. Just to prove a point, being like, oh, I was like, oh no, you just ask. Let me just go with Ray Allen. Oh, let me just score this possession here. Ray Allen right to the basket, dunk. You see that? If I decide to score with another player, I can, just not Gallinari. I just cannot score with Gallinari. And it was the exact same in the last game. He feels clunky. He feels so clunky on the ball. Good move by him. I'm being well and truly outplayed though. My opponent is torching me, so fair play to him. But like Gallinari in this game has scored two points. Spin. He didn't even trigger a spin when I spun the controller. He got me clamped. He's got me absolutely clamped right there, Lena. 
Give me that. I mean, he can shoot wide open. That's what that's what Gallo does. That's the extent of what Gallo can do in this game is shoot wide open shots. And it's disappointing because Jeremy Grant, he moved so well. Jeremy Grant just felt so good as a card. His release felt better. Like, Gallo's release is brilliant. That's kind of the only positive to him. Like, he just... I know he's Gatorade, but he just doesn't... He just feels clunky. He just doesn't move well. He's like... I thought, you know what, he'll be similar to Hito. Nah, nah, nah. He shoots the ball better than Hito. But I said it in the warm-up. I said it in the thing. He just moves clunky. And if you need him... Like, there is no reason to buy him. And I'm not even going to say there's no reason to go for him over Hito Turkoglu. If you get him, fine. He's fine. There's no reason not only to get him over Hito Turkoglu. There is no reason to use him instead of Lamar Odom. There's no reason to use him over Thurl Bailey. No reason to use him over Tatum. Heck, I don't think he's that much better than DeMar DeRozan. I think if you give DeMar DeRozan range extender, I don't think he's that much better than DeMar, and I hate DeMar DeRozan. So anyway, yeah, that's the video. Very disappointed with this card. He just feels clunky. He doesn't move well. And honestly, his shooting is magnificent. That's all he does. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.